Hey guys, welcome back. In today's video, we're going to be creating a type of a chase game, but a special and a totally different one. So we're going to be coming on our scratch web page and clicking on create. In this project, we'll need a background called a boardwalk, like one sprite which is going to be a bear walking and rest of the sprites being fruits. It can be two, three fruits, five, six fruits, one, two fruits, whatever. So first of all, we're gonna go ahead and choose a sprite bear walking. We're going to choose a backdrop going in outdoors and clicking on boardwalk. We're gonna go ahead and delete the scratch cat and choosing a sprite which is going to be an apple. Then we might do another one which might be a banana. A banana. And just one more will be good like a strawberry. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna make the bear size 50. That way it's smaller and it's gonna be a bit hard for it to move. So first of all, when green flag is going to be clicked, actually when the, this sum, when the up arrow is going to be clicked, we're going to change Y by 10. Just like this, we're going up and it's changing. So we're gonna duplicate this block, change it into down arrow and make it minus 10. Now what we're gonna do, now we're gonna do it event again and when the right arrow is going to be clicked, we're gonna make it move 10 steps. We're gonna duplicate it again, change it to left arrow and make it move minus 10 steps. There we go, it's moving and moving and moving. So now we're gonna go in apples and when green flag is going to be clicked, we're gonna have it, we're repeating forever that go into random position. Too fast, so we're gonna go back in controls and get one second. We're gonna do the same for bananas and also strawberry. And there you go, you can see that we have the code already. Now what we're gonna do, let's just see. And as you can see, it's moving. So we're gonna go back in apples. And when green flag is going to be cleared, we're going to create a variable, which is going to be called score. It can be points or whatever. So when green flag is going to be cleared, we're going to set score to zero. We're gonna go in a, we're gonna go in controls, get a forever block and an if then block inside. We're gonna go in sensing and if it is touching the bear, you know, bear walking, then what we're gonna do, we are going to start sound jump. But before that, we are going to change the variable. It means score by one. Same we're gonna go ahead and do with bananas and strawberry. And there you see, we have our code ready. So let's test it out. And as you can see, if we touch a fruit for longer, then it will give us more score. That's why I call it my special and unique chase game. Let's give the title right now. You guys can also create a game like that. I don't mind if you copy. But remember to like, share and subscribe my channel if you want more videos like this. BW, if you like this, then don't forget to share it with your family and friends. I'll see you next time. Bye guys.